Would you like to access the power of challenging emotions instead of being triggered or derailed by them? How can you approach the full spectrum of emotions with greater curiosity, humor, and play. This healing journey to build confidence with emotional resilience is for you. I'm Christelle Arcucci, and I'm on a mission to change your experience of pleasure, power, and money. Learn more about my work at EmbodySoulPurpose.com. You're listening to the Desire Sessions podcast, the lightning path to discover your desires and clear what's blocking you from receiving. Asking for what you want and receiving unapologetically is a revolutionary act. It's time to be the one you're looking for. This healing and hypnotic audio journey is designed to restore your nervous system and reclaim your power. It's ideal you're listening in a place that you can relax and receive. Let's begin by bringing yourself more fully into your body, more fully into this moment. I invite you to focus on your exhale. Feel heavy on what you are resting on. Let each exhale be a little longer than the inhale. Settling, settling, settling. Soften the soles of your feet, the palms of your hands. Soften the base of your tongue, your eyes, even if they're closed. Relax your belly and focus on your breath moving in and moving out. Breath moving in with ease. Breath moving out with ease. Inhale and exhale. Each inhale is collecting your energy and attention more fully into your body mind. Each exhale is clearing space inside. As you exhale, you can imagine erasing a whiteboard or a blackboard, clearing away any events from the day or anything that may be happening later, clearing space, clearing time to be here, listening to my voice, integrating your body your mind, your heart, and your soul, creating integration of all levels of your being is much easier than it sounds, feeling your breath, sensing your body, and bringing your attention in a relaxed state into this moment helps you land more comfortably in your body, more comfortably in this moment. As we begin this journey of exploring your emotional landscape, developing resilience, and building confidence in who you are and what you do, and right now you are letting yourself Settle even more, letting your body be heavy, settled, calm, and you find yourself walking along a country road. It feels so peaceful, beautiful spring day, the birds chirping in the trees, pecking around in the new grass sprouts. You see the flowers blooming on the trees. There is fresh rain in the air and you can feel yourself relaxing into the movement, the pulsation the rhythm of spring, letting yourself 
Enjoy the moment. Enjoy the scents, the sounds, the taste. Letting yourself take in everything around you, even beyond what seems obvious. And as you're walking, you feel the rains come again, even though the sun is shining. And before your eyes, a giant rainbow appears in the sky, taking your breath away filling you with awe, wonder, astonishment. And you notice the colors of the rainbow are different frequencies, different vibrations. And as you are looking at the rainbow, you feel a transmission of wisdom, Seeing the beauty of the colors working so well together, blending together, seamlessly transitioning from one color to another and creating such profound beauty coming from the storm. Sometimes we can resist the storm. But in this moment, you feel open and curious about a different approach to the storm because you know that the rains are what brings the sprouting grass again, the blooming trees, the wildflowers, the birds, and the animals coming back to life after a long winter. In this moment, you feel the depth of appreciation, knowing that the time over the winter, your own version of hibernation, slowing down, longer nights, darker, colder weather, this time of turning inward is valuable to you. It teaches you about yourself, develops your ability to look inside and be in the darkness, be in the cold, be in the winter where so much is in a deep state of rest. This one experience of seeing this rainbow blasting across the sky on the edge of the storm with the sun bursting through is giving you insights into your emotional intelligence. How to work with emotions when an emotion can seem so dark and heavy, and cold, and relentless, knowing that the spring will always come, moving out of the state of fighting against the storm, or the winter, or the emotional challenges that we all face, seeing the rainbow reminds you that Each color in the rainbow is an expression of life energy. It is a way of coloring your life in a way that makes it more interesting. As you are standing, viewing the rainbow, receiving insights, as if through some transmission of magic through the drops of rain and the vision of the rainbow in front of you, opening this pathway of seeing that challenges are part of the magic, part of the adventure. And when you can stay open, curious, playful, 
and maybe even have a good laugh about the ways in which you replay emotional patterns over and over and over and over again. Like on the merry-go-round as a child, spinning around and around and around. It was fun then, even sometimes when you would spin too long and feel a little queasy afterwards. It was still the great adventure of playing with the spinning. But often now, as an adult, we want to control the energy, control or eliminate the emotions, to be seen in a certain light, rather than enjoying the play of emotions. It's so easy to enjoy this full spectrum of emotions when you're reading a book, listening to a story, or watching a movie. The variety and play of emotions, challenges, conflicts, triggers, triumphs, is exactly what makes the story so interesting. It captivates our attention, yet often in our own lives, somehow, somewhere along the way, we've gotten some idea that it's wrong and bad in our own lives. (sighs) And as you exhale, you feel a level of clearing deep in your own body, a clearing in your psyche, clearing the pathway for a new perspective to enjoy the journey, to enjoy the play of emotions, to see the challenges as opportunities, to receive the emotion or the trigger as an invitation. What is the invitation of this moment? What is the invitation of this emotion? What is the invitation of this interaction? Ah, settling, settling, settling. And as you are breathing, you feel this golden light like the sun radiating from the center of your body just below the curve of your ribcage and above your navel, golden, brilliant like the sun, restoring your power, reclaiming your sense of play, reimagining what is possible in navigating this great story of your life. It would be so dull if it was all the same. In this moment, this bright golden light that is coming from inside and outside at the same time, captivating your attention, is changing your perception, is opening your mind to be curious, to explore humor, To enjoy the play, the divine play of your life as an epic tale, ups and downs, all of the seasons of your life, spring, summer, autumn, winter, welcoming all of the flavors of life, sweet, sour, salty, bitter, savory, knowing that the variety and the beautiful blend of all the flavors is what makes a meal so interesting, so delicious, that there's subtlety and boldness and spice and different textures and flavors 
And just like you deeply appreciate that in your meals, you are opening your mind, body, heart in this moment to deeply appreciate the flavors of emotions, energy in motion, the invitation of life force energy as it moves through you as you. It becomes more interesting when you see it from this perspective. And still the brilliant rainbow splashed across the sky. Ah, the transmission of light, rain, creating this rainbow of colors, opening your whole being to receive the transmission of greater variety, greater confidence in your ability to explore and express emotions, the play of color and light the play of the storm and the sun creating such profound beauty, opening your mind, opening your heart, opening your body to receive the power of the storm, the falling rain, the golden sun that is outside, that is inside, that is brilliant and shines a light through the rains to create the rainbow, the full spectrum of emotions that are created from the storm, that are created from the life-giving rain. Ah, so open, so open, so open, curious, playful, And yes, finding humor in the upset, the advanced strategy of snapping out of the downward spiral of devastating emotions to be able to find lightness and humor, to even have a good laugh at ourselves when we get so wrapped up, so tangled and amplifying the momentum and the power of the downward spiral. In any moment, we can stop the spiral, have a good laugh at ourselves, and choose to change directions, choose to channel the power of the life force energy onto a different timeline, getting curious about what else is possible, trying to be a brick wall, When life is giving us lessons is the fast track to suffering. Being curious about how the energy of emotions, emotions, how this energy wants to move, breathe, and be in our own lives and experiences is a part of the masterpiece of our life. It is how we are creating our living legacy. It is the story that we are writing on the pages of our life. Yes, sometimes there are miserable pages. And the invitation is to be able to step outside of the misery. To be able to observe, witness, and hold compassion for the misery. The trick of the mind says these emotions will last forever, that you will get stuck in the quicksand of emotion sucking you down and sucking the life out of you. But in truth, when we allow the emotions to run their course, to move through our body, mind, heart, when we allow the emotions to have their way with us, it generally will last for 90 seconds when we fully give ourselves over to that frequency and currency of the emotion. In that moment of giving yourself over, breathing, being, and moving, 
with the invitation, creating with the power that life force is giving you, changing the conditioning that we were given, that emotions are bad, must be confined, contained, or shoved away. What about the curiosity, the adventure of exploring what this flavor of life force energy is inviting us to do? What can we create with the brilliance of our embodied confidence and emotional resilience to be able to be like the rainbow? This brilliant splash of color in the sky while it's still storming and the sun is shining. The colors blending together so radiant with the seamless beauty. Allowing ourselves the opportunity to explore and express the full spectrum the full rainbow of emotions without limitation. Hmm, yes. Finding creative and life-enhancing ways to move with the energy that life is bringing us. How can we collaborate and co-create with what life is bringing us? Hmm, yes. And you still feel the raindrops falling, the sun blasting through the clouds, creating this brilliant rainbow. And then the scene is gone, and you remember your body is resting, eyes closed, listening to my voice, journeying to a place deep inside where your confidence is like the brilliant sun in the center of your body, and your relationship with emotions is more flexible, fluid, curious, playful, and funny, allowing what used to be triggers emotionally to be opportunities and invitations to explore what life is giving you, what life is inviting you to create. And you begin taking deeper breaths, enlivening your body, bringing gentle movement back into your hands and toes, turning your head side to side, (sighs) moving your wrists and your ankles, Coming even more fully back into the room that you're in. Coming back into the space that you're in. And as you feel ready, gently opening your eyes, taking in the light, the color, the textures, the objects in the room, the space that you're in. Thank you for being a part of the pleasure-led movement. I'm honored to support your embodied spiritual awakening. I want to extend a special invitation to our listeners. If you're craving a deeper exploration of your desires, whether they are personal or professional, consider booking a desire session by phone with me. It's a unique opportunity to delve into your dreams, purpose, and clear limiting belief codes that are blocking you. To schedule your desire session, visit desiresession.com. Your desires deserve attention and I'd love to support you. Ready for a personalized rites of passage with me? The Embody Soul Purpose series focuses on integrating parts of you that were lost along the way in a soul retrieval process and activation of all seven main chakras, energy centers. Embrace all aspects of your past, no matter what happened, so that you can create the greatest chapter of your life, no matter what your current age. If you're interested to explore working with me to embody soul purpose in the Rites of Passage series, please visit embodysoulpurpose.com. Leave a review and follow on your favorite podcast app or visit desiresessionspodcast.com. I believe in you and the magic power of your soul. 
I'm sending you so much love.